let's do something else here that I have not done. I mean, this is this is a really shame that I haven't done in the video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head back. We're gonna go back like this, just like this here. We're gonna do this here, and what we're gonna do is. Is already something that I should have done. Yeah, actually, it's video recorded. Uh, what you have seen just right now is also an interesting issue. But first thing, this here is what I want to see. Where is it going to transfer me to? Well, it's a completely different issue than what it was yesterday. So it's too late. Uh, Google updated its principles. But yep, uh, yesterday. It's exactly what happened. I would enter it uh, in the engine because this was not the location. Why have I done it this way? Because this was not the location where I was. The crime initially did not take place here. The crime initially did not took place here. Do you understand what the fuck I'm saying? It did not take, the crime initially did not take place in front of the city hall. It did not took place in front of the city hall. It, is, it didn't take initially here. I was looking for this location here. So what I was doing is, I figured out that this was not a location. So the next thing that happened was, it was the school I wanted to find. Yeah? And initially, they did not even know where the crime is going to take place. And this takes us to the next level, which I almost mentioned a few times the time earlier, but I did not. But I will do it now. I'm going to finish this. Right now, I'm going to finish this stuff here. You see what What do you see here? Do you see it? Do you see it? Okay, let me demonstrate to you. In the Czech and the Slovenian language, it's a very similar... It's a very similar language. However... There is a difference here that quickly, if you would look, and I'm not the only one, that's why I'm going to mention you this stuff. Others notice that too. They translated to me this palace with Namestito Bolnico. I briefly used the restroom, that's why I left. Yes. So if I go back to this issue, Namestito Bolonico, this is what the psychiatrist Koch was using to intimidate me together with the police. Yes, if you quickly look at that in Slovenian language, you will see Namestia, not, you will not see, I did not see, that's why I did not mention a previous video, right? I don't mention any of these issues in a previous video, right? But this was used during MK Ultra to intimidate with. Namestito Bolnico means a placement of the men, of the ill people. And because this was the stuff during the psychiatric hospitalization, which somewhat is located in also old building, all sort of some sort of villa, I would say, they compare this issue when you see one. You should see yourself already inside of the psychiatric hospital. See, this is the difference between the reality, having the ability to demonstrate the reality of the torture, of the abuse, of what you have also seen under the Slovenian president, Natasha Pierce Musar, so-called. who, in a parenthesis, alerted, became uh, alerted about the violence that goes on online. You know, she doesn't worry about the stuff she did. She got herself involved in real violence and is trying to cover up with... She's trying to prevent from being placed on a proper location that's basically into the jail. The difference between reality, having the ability to portray reality as it was, 
and a schizophrenia. I should say mental illness. For which psychiatrist Peter Kapsch suggested me at least once. He suggested once. He did not suggest that, but he mentioned once. Even intimidation, getting him intimidated is a form of mental illness. It is. It is. It's just a different kind of mental illness. This is such a shit, such a coward, that I felt really, really, really deserves this type of attention together with other garbage that was involved in MK Ultra that is really, really necessary to uh, to pay them attention as close so that the world can see what type of garbage do we have inside of the parliament's politics, what exactly taxpayers' money go, where is heading all this, what kind of, what's happening with all this stuff, who are these people, what exactly are they doing? These psychiatrists and the politicians and stuff. Because the difference between the psychiatrists and the politician, there was zero when it comes to my case. The psychiatrists were the politicians. The psychiatrists reserved the right to be politicians, to act like a politicians, and even threaten the politicians with the psychiatry. It's unprecedented, the stuff I'm talking about, and it must stop by using these people as a, examples on, on how this stuff is stopped. Nobody's going to intimidate me with anything. Now, Meshchia Banikov, I had no idea what that is, but in uh, Slovak language, that probably uh, means location. Uh, Baniki, Ban, Baniki, that's probably 20 in a mess. No Mestia Banikov. I have no fucking idea. Maybe some address or something like that. Maybe it's some kind of uh, square or something like this. Uh, Bani also means in the Croatian language, uh, it's also something that, that, that will be related to um, like a fine square or something like this, or um, excluded from public view area that would be like exclusive for some politician like it was Yossi Rostik or somebody something like this in that sense like uh, uh, French um, uh, I cannot recall right now but you know the villas they have or um, Bonnie would let's say apply also to um, a garden or something like that like uh, Charles has his private beautiful gardens that the royals have and stuff like that, you know. Uh, the walk, the private walk for this for these elites, or uh, it could be also square, it could be also city-wise issue. Okay? So just, just you know, let this be a part number two so that you understand how I did the investigation. I did the investigation exactly the way I should. I did not stop at this place here. This stop, this place here, this stop, it didn't make sense to me because I wanted to go to the original, to the place where it all started. And where it all started, I demonstrated you. It exactly started at this place here. It started at this place. This is where the assassination was. And because it all started right here, this location here, and because police officers... To them, this location here, um, when you look at it, these colors, when you drugged up, to them it looked like uh, uh, promising. You see, go, you can see it from here, but uh, when it all started, I was here, I was located like this. Not when it all started. When it all started, I was located like this. It's somewhat, when you're dropped up, to them it appeared a good trait, something that could be used for the confusion. To them it appeared that using something like this would be a good to go. Everything they have done was based on observation, extremely close observation. 
they had notes, they were writing down everything I was doing, how I view, how I was doing. They had psychiatrists always next to it. They had psychiatrists, and so they had this, like a gradisher. Uh, they, had, they had different kind of psychiatrists. They would go along and watch and observe. And from Lugana, from psychiatric hospital, they would have psychiatrists. Physicians also, they would watch. Sometimes they were not psychiatrists. Sometimes they also used physicians. The same garbage. The same trash. It depended who had time and who wanted to prove himself more with a hooliganism, with a crime, with a barbarism, with a torture. It all depended who wanted to prove himself more. Sometimes you don't even have psychiatrists. And so since it all started right here, and since I have declined to see myself in this, this is the way it was. Because they reorchestrated this, and I was negative about this place. Do you understand me what I'm saying? First thing, the first place where it took place was here. And where they, they reorchestrated the whole thing again about the so-called shooting, the panic and stuff, torture. That was negative about this. I didn't want to go and look for a suspect. That's what they wanted me, to look for the suspect together with the police. They suggested me, I'm a police officer, go and find him, and so on. This was a lunacy, unbelievable. And they realized that, however, that this here, this issue was closer to me, to this issue here, which they wanted me to relate to, as a city hall. Yes? They continued with switching with this location and this location, this location, that location, this location, that location, suggesting also that it's in another city, that's in another place, and so on and so forth. Yeah. Till they were sure that would be intimidating and shitty enough that I would not even touch, that I would walk away from it eventually, rather than face off with reality about what took place. Yeah? So that you understand exactly how this stuff was also done. What exactly physicians in this case that would come from Slovenia? They had physicians, they had the Belgrade, they have Serbs. They, they delivered the Serbian Chetniks whenever they went to the Slovakia and Poland and all this. Slovakia was the most violent Eastern European country. Just as violent as Belarus and Russia. Maybe even more. I have no fucking idea who was more violent. In Slovakia, you can get anything if you pay. It's not a problem to kill anybody in a bright daylight. As long as you pay for it, you're an influential person, you're going to cover the expenses to the state. These people you see here, they'll go after you and fucking kill you in a broad daylight. And say that you jumped under the bus. That's not the schizophrenia, that's a Slovakia. And Slovakia is a schizophrenia. I'm looking to show you what they did to me with my car, with my Skoda, what they did with me, what they did to me. You saw it, what they did to me. So don't fucking tell me that this is not schizophrenia. They fuck you up when they destroy your car like this, when they do the stuff like this. Fucking sucks, man. And that's a violence, by the way. Mrs. Natasha Pierce Musar, and I see uh, Mr. Luca Massets over there. That's a violence when you do the stuff like this. You know how angry I was? Exactly according with the MK Ultra instructions. I slept in the trunk. I slept I slept inside the car with a trunk broken, everything broken, and I waited for these guys to come back. Because I promised myself despite what went on the night earlier 
that I would kill these people myself, barehanded, if they would only come back. I feel sorry that I missed on the fucking opportunity to face them, even that they were armed with a shuffle gardening. And according to MK Ultra, they also had other gadgets, including the pepper spray and batons and stuff like that. That's how angry I was. This is about the violence, Mrs. Natasha Pirtz Muser. This is about you, about your Slovenian police. This is what you did. You're right, this is about violence. Question is, when are you going to be responsible for it? 52 years with your Milan Kuchan, who hired you for this stuff. This is all Milan Kuchan. This is all Bord Pahor. This is all Tanya Fayon. This is all Gregor Golovic. These are the so-called leftists from Slovenia. These are the so-called liberals from Slovenia. Katarina Kresal and many more names. I am going to be looking for you. None of you. None of you. None of you with the police director, with the police administration that did this stuff. None of you exempted. None of you exempted from this. Here are many of you. You said... You know what the subject was during MK Ultra, but there are so many. We're not going to go and waste so many people for one. What it takes to save one is what Donald Trump claimed. No, this is not the way it is. The way it is, is I'm a human being. You're a human shit. And when it comes to the human shit, it doesn't really matter how many. It just needs to be cleaned up. It needs to be wiped away. Make path for the decent people. For society to grow, for the world to be nice, green, normal place. Such was the World War II. Liberals, the so-called leftists, and I would not discriminate against their opposition which gave them all the necessary support for this crime to be carried out against me. Just as criminal and even more corrupt. I don't know which one of them, in competition with one another, who's going to make more damage. In the end, without absolutely nothing, even with the health ruined, I had to do it all by myself. This was not too far from there, actually. Ostrava, you know, on a Czech side. There ain't nothing funny about this. There ain't nothing funny when they destroy you absolutely everything. You have nothing, and they go for and destroy you absolutely everything you have. This was form of intimidation too. This was the location where I was tortured. Probably for 35 years at this location. I was brought here to this location as a child. The people who saw me, the people who met me, are the people that grew up practically with me whenever I was delivered to Czech Republic, in this part of the Czech Republic. Alex Jones talks about, uh, he talks about, he, he loves to talk about Illuminati is, um, I don't know, and sacrifice, uh, drinking blood from the children and uh, uh, making a rituals. This is about real fucking rituals. But this is not Illuminati. This is not your secret elites. 
only. This is where the police, this is where the Slovenian, Czech, Slovak, Polish police will come and do the stuff, torture, whoever wanted to come here, involve people from the US, from Israel, from all over the place, they will come and torture us, please. That's how they were earning the money. In accelerated a rate after the fall of the Soviet Union. I was automatically labeled as a German. I was labeled as a German. I was German. And it appealed to the Germans so they could point out there is existence of a schizophrenia in neighboring countries. And those from the neighboring countries needed the money. So it was a tit for tat. It was a money for killing, basically. They encouraged one another into violence. Violence, finally, with a Robert Fico that British royals needed to prove that I was so dangerous that I was actually deadly to be around with. Because they claimed that I put them in a dangerous zone, in a deadly situation, I don't know how many times. And it was why it was necessary to do the stuff like this with me. They became politically, politically correct per extermination procedure which they exercised against me. This is a part two of the video that you've seen. Now, I thought that, that I need your explanation how that building found its way, that the entire technology, how the police have used that stuff, how basically they have done it. And I think, not that I think, I did it just the way it was. You should see these Slovenian physicians, these doctors, this honorable people, this most honorable society that we have, who think about so highly about themselves with the psychiatrists, they act so smart, so normal. They like to move their heads, they like to move up and down their heads, because they know about everything. Already based on the police reports that were given to them before they even come on the meetings. Such a smart people, so talented, so brilliant, love to talk about the World War II, want to be seen as extinguished members of the societies of productive people, people who are worthy of something, people who do something for the society, people who move the society forward, when in fact it's a shit, it's a human shit.